The other secret transformation! You son of a bitch! Fuck you! Rampaging Chopper! Only problem is, is that Garp is a little bit too fast for this. I'll just keep wailing on him. Get a little bit away from him. Come here! I said... Come here! Uh, I can't grab him, what the fuck? By the way, Chopper is going to be constantly losing health when he's in this form. Just because. Good news, I can't be knocked down. And I can't be grabbed. But I also can't really do any... Dodge it! Fuck you! If I can just grab him once, do the special move once, and I'll be happy. There we go, he's, he's far enough. Grab him! What the fuck, I can't grab Garp? Do the smash attack? Fuck you. Oh, there goes Rampaging Chopper. He did good though, he did good. Nami, you're up. First, the only your only job is to revive Luffy. There. Everything else you do, I don't care. I got nine mixed candies, and I got the, I got the monster trio still in my reserves. Thunderbolt of Tempo! Didn't do a damn thing. What about Mirage Five Ways? I don't know. Missed completely. Come on, Mirage! Yeah! Tempo Fata Mirage! Who's doing that? Yeah! Oh yeah, I was, I was about to say, there's no way I'm going to be able to get this guy to stand still long enough to get him under a thundercloud. Uh, Nami, you know what? You did better than I expected. You revived Luffy, which was your job, and then you actually did some damage to him. Why is he not using special moves? Huh. Oh, Silver Mist! You know it would be cool if uh, Ashura was not a special move, but a secret transformation. Kind of like Rampaging Topper and Nightmare Luffy. Hell man, it's... Okay, so it's like... Chopper can go into Rumble Mode and Rampaging Mode. Luffy can go into Gear 2nd, Gear 3rd, and Nightmare Mode. Usopp can turn into Soga King. Sanji can go Diablo Jambe. But Zoro only has special move, Ashura. I want him to transform into Ashura and do some special attacks, you know? That's what I want to see. Alright, I don't have enough stamina for that. I have... Oh, wait, no, hold on. Let it read... No, shit! Not good! Get out of there! I got out of there. Okay. How much stamina? 130? I can do one more special move with that. Can't I? I cannot. Okay, never mind. Huck. Climbing the tower, Dragon Blaze! 62 pound cannon! Dragon Twister! Garp's done. I didn't even have to use Sanji or Luffy! And he didn't use a special move! What the hell? Something feels wrong here. He didn't do a special move once. Huh. Well, it's over at least. And I should be able to get the secret monument that they were talking about. Yeah. Yare, yare. Hell yeah, man. <laughs> Don't you doubt it. You shit me? Yeah, we would have been dead. He didn't even use a special move. I was expecting him to, like, throw a gigantic cannonball or something. Some rice crackers. Kick ass. I'll use those right now. This is already cooked food. Yay! Oh, not a whole lot of people can use... Oh, because they're all dead. Everybody's dead. Alright, cool. 
Well, that's it. No more bosses. Hold on, I want to get the rest of this island discovered. All that's left to do- oh shit. All that's left to do is fight the boss on hard mode and then play through unlimited difficulty, which will present some new challenges. Definitely, definitely present some new challenges. I can't even go over here. That sucks. Alright. We gotta get back to the ship and make sure everybody's revived. I'm missing 1% of this map. Where is it? It could possibly be... Up there, or right there. That's probably it, yep. I'll discover both. Oh, everybody's dead. Hold on, who has the most stamina? Luffy and Sanji, all right. So yeah, the two extra bosses that you have to beat the game once to even unlock, Whitebeard and Garp. I gotta say, Whitebeard was definitely more difficult because he had the one hit KO. Garp was more difficult because he had the ability to grab us and he would not flinch for anything. So the only way to even hurt him was with special moves. That shit, where am I going? Where am I going? Why can't I run for longer than 20 feet? Alright. Right up here. It's here. Okay, I discovered that little chunk. Way. I want to get 100% of this map complete, damn it! Why can't I run downstairs? Oh well. I guess that would be kind of dangerous. I need to get... down there. Fuck that. Oh, I don't have any rubber bands! Shit! I gotta run the whole way there! And I'm not gonna- I got one more revival elixir. It's not gonna go with me to the second- or the actual third playthrough. So I have to use it for the final boss. If I need to. I'm actually surprised that I did not need Nightmare Luffy for either of those fights. Using Nightmare Luffy the first time I fought Whitebeard actually got me killed, so that was wrong. And now I know how to use, um, Nightmare- not Nightmare. Monster Point Chopper. Which, for some reason, in all translations, it's called Rampaging Chopper. It's accurate, but not exactly what I would call it. It's Monster Point, man. It fits. It, it, especially now, and after the time skip, he can use it regularly and has it under control. It's officially called Monster Point now. I guess it's because he can't control Monster Point. It can't technically be called Monster Point. Alright. Ugh. Alright. Back to Sanji, he's got full stamina. So after this, I'm just gonna go fight the, um, the final boss. Again. And then I'm gonna start doing the unlimited playthrough. I'm not gonna record the entire thing, but I will record the, you know, exclusive stuff that you can only get in unlimited difficulty. Which, there are some things, you know, there's a boss rush. Which will, once I complete the boss rush, it'll unlock these other two special co-op moves. There's one for Zoro and Sanji combining together. And there's one for Brook, Nami, Robin, and Usopp combining together. I have to beat the boss rush just to unlock those. Okay, we've got 100%. Let's get the hell out of here. Ah. Come on, come on, come on, go! Damn it! One more stamina. Run away! And once I unlock those other two co-op moves, I'll actually show off all the moves in their entirety. Because there are a lot of them. And then I'll probably go into depth about, you know, my favorite combos and why and all that crap. Anyway! We're done! Yay! Oh wait! There's something else I can do! Development! No, never mind. Database. The music! Yes, the music! Look at all this music. Where's the final boss music? There we go. Demon of Doom. That's not it.
Yay! I like this music. The main theme music? Danger, tough battle, pacifista, all the different themes. That was the end of the game, gobbery theme. That's for the verses. Whatever. And we have all the characters unlocked now, don't we? Nope, there's still one more. Damn. Oh, there's another one. What the hell? What? How many fucking unlock? Oh, that's right. Those are the only. Those are the things you can only fight in unlimited difficulty. Ha ha ha! We'll have to deal with that later. Anyway, I'm done here. Gonna go fight the final boss again. View the credits again. Do all that crap again. Alright, next time on Unlimited Cruise 2, the Unlimited Difficulty highlights and the exclusive stuff from Unlimited Difficulty, the boss rush, and showing off all the moves. Thanks for watching everybody, see you next time on Unlimited Cruise 2, goodbye.